Hello everyone at Doshwants 27s channel. This is Vincent Vukovic from DICE letting you guys know about the latest Xbox One patch update to Battlefield 4. Yes, I do realize that we're cranking up these patches faster than you usually last when you masturbate, but EA is cracking down the whip ever since they had class action lawsuit filed against them. I just got off a 58 hour coke, I mean coding binge, but I'm going to quickly go over what we fixed in this patch and hopefully we won't introduce new bugs. I mean, we're not Treyarch, right? <coughs> Obliteration bomb bug. <coughs> Music bug and capture the flag. <coughs> We did fix some of the game freezing issues that I know Dalshwantz27 has been experiencing and we got rid of Revive Bug that we introduced with the December 13th patch. We also reduced the kill trade possibility so that you won't get killed even when you shoot first because the other player's bullet multiplier was incorrectly calculated. We again made more fixes to single player progress, now you only have to try challenges three times instead of five. You guys thought you were suave in road killing the shit out of multiple people like the Mav in Battlefield 3 before that patch, but Lightning did strike twice with this particular bug and we removed it. We fixed more bugs and diffuse so now that the game mode is actually somewhat playable, but you still have to wait for my beard to grow in before you can start each round. The queue for servers has finally been enabled, so goodbye to the no free commander slots message, although the servers might crash every once in a while. Tis problem we are looking into. We also fixed a few texture glitches that I spoke about in the last video, however, there's still those audio bugs, I mean, who needs to hear the droning of a helicopter engine anyways? Wait, what, you need to hear sound when you're locked on in a vehicle? Shit, we should probably get on on that. Anyways, there are still plenty of more fixes to come in Broken Field 4, and EA is making us do patches so fast, we don't even have time to test them, so that's what you guys are for. Keep on reporting them on Battlelog, and thankfully we have dedicated servers to host the forums, because there's more bug threads than a Chinese sweatshop. So this way you can count on us getting feedback directly from you. I've got to go, I think EA is listening.